All right, so here I have the couple of files. Um, I used the 2011 version of the Trader Studio installer. That's already installed, and now I'm going to install the Sistran 4 SDL Trader Studio plugin. So this is the, the free add-on that you can download from the SDL website. Um, what I'll do is I'll run that right here. And when you run this, you will go through a couple of standard uh, screens. I mean, in, in my case, it seems that it already has an installation there, so it's probably going to offer me to uh, perhaps repair it, uh, change or remove it, and that sort of things. And what I'll do is I'll simply say change it, and it will be similar in terms of what you should see when you go through it the first time, which is that you will basically see an installation option to put it on the Trados 2009 or the new version 2011. All right, so I'm going to say let's go and install it on the 2011, which I have here, and go. And so at that point, you're pretty much done. This is a very quick installation of the plugin, and you're done. So that basically is all you need to then go and, um, let's say, restart the Trados environment from the Start menu, SDL, Trados Studio. You can see that it's off the, cap the screen capture, but... Um, I'm going to launch it right there, so you'll see the traditional uh, startup, and I'm on a trial here. Let's go continue that, and at that point, you'll see the Trados environment startup and the availability of the plugin to translate machine trans do the machine translation with Sistran. Where do you see that? Well, it's under your project settings. So in the project settings here. If it's not been enabled yet, you should see the option to add it. But in this case, we have the translation memory and automated translation. We had it already installed before, and so therefore it will appear right here. This is where you will also see your translation memories and um, some other options. There's a, a variety of other tools you can add to that.